kitchen in the kitchen with Lucy Bell. Hey, happy Thanksgiving. It's Lucy Bell the May here, the reigning queen in Beaver Pond, here with another episode of Bitchin' in the Kitchen. And I'm so glad to be part of the Thanksgiving show. First of all, on Thanksgiving morning, you should always start out with mimosas. Yes. So what better way? You always have to have a bottle of Prosecco or some kind of bubbly to get started. Yes. Woo! That's a good one. Mmm. Ooh. Well, we came up with a great idea in Beaver Pond. It is called Punch in a Jug. <laughs> yes. So just get your empty milk jug cleaned out, a funnel. You take your apple cider, two cups of apple cider. You pour it in here. Yeah, it's too bad that we're on another shutdown. I tell you, it's awful. Now, you take a little fireball. Yeah, good stuff. You know, I never cared for fireball that much until I started cooking with it. Mm -hmm. It's quite a nice little spice. We are going to do a half a cup of fireball. Yeah, somewhere about that. There you go. Yeah, it's good stuff. And now comes Prosecco. So this is almost like a souped up mimosa. So I'm going to do a cup of Prosecco. And if you would like something a little stronger, throw in some vodka. Yeah. Ooh, let's see how this tastes now. Mmm. Oh, it tastes just like an apple pie almost. Mmm. So good. So this next drink starts with rimming, okay? So what we're going to do, take a little maple syrup, put it in the saucer here. And I've got some crushed nuts here with a couple of whole pecans. We're just going to get some maple syrup on there. Just make sure you get it all the way around. Yeah. And then take it and get it in those crushed nuts there, those chopped pecans. Mm -mm -mm. My bitch this week. It's pretty much this COVID incident and being shut down again. Because like I said earlier, we don't get to have a parade. We don't get to have the pie eating contest. And most of all, I'm not going to be able to be show off my talent in the lead role that the Beaver Pond players were going to produce. Uh, the landing of the pilgrims in Beaver Pond. Yes, I had the role, the lead role of Slippery Beaver. Okay, so back to our cocktail. This is our shaker. We've got our glasses rimmed. So now what I'm going to do, we will take this. Is so this is three ounces right here. So we are going to take six ounces of rum chata. I don't know if you can see that too good. If you have a chance, try some of this stuff. It's really good. Okay, so six ounces. There's three, six. Then we're going to do six ounces of coffee liqueur. I do hope everybody has a nice Thanksgiving. And you know what? If you can't be with friends, get on that Zoom and Zoom for a bit. See everybody or call your friends. Now we're doing three ounces of bourbon. And now we'll take this. Okay. Give a point in these beautiful glasses. Oh, it looks so good. Little dab of whipped cream. Then I'll take a little pecan. Now I know some of you guys say pecans, but we say pecan where I'm from because pecan is what you keep beside your bed at night. And cheers. Hey, you guys have a great Thanksgiving. And you know what? Please, please, please watch your distance. Stay safe. And let's get this virus under control so we can all enjoy next year. Social.